Hi guys, it's MK Expert here. And Lil Sassy Gabby. <laughs> And today, my mom is joining us! Hi guys! We're going to be making It's Alive Slime! We're doing slime experiments with slime. So uh, let's open this up and see what's inside. Yeah! Ooh, look what I got! Ooh, what's with this? Oh, I don't think we need that. In this kit, you'll get a mixing cup. A wave dome. A grouper scooper. A slime stick. Dropper. A gradual cylinder. Dome top. Dome base. And a plunger for the slime of place. So yeah, I think it's called the slime o nature base. <laughs> this is probably the base. What does it do? Let's see. Oh! Oh! <laughs> That's intense. All right, I can't wait to get that started. So, in this kit, guys, there are over 20 science slime experiments that you can do in here. So, we're gonna try out McKinley's favorite one. What slime are we doing? Mutant slime. What you need is cornstarch, water, and food coloring. Ooh, I can't wait. Mm -hmm. It does not come in the kit. You will actually have to get your own mixing bowl for the mutant slime. So parents, make sure you have a couple of extra mixing bowls on hand to make this slime. Step one, measure in half a cup of cornstarch. Uh oh, oh, whoa. <laughs> Better clean that. Corn is good. Corn, does it taste good? Ew! Yeah. Mom! Not good. Don't eat it. Now we're going to pour in it. Three to four tablespoons of water. One, two, three, four. Now it's time to mix it up. Mom can be the mixer. Yeah. We're going to need a lot more water. I didn't let the water. Don't drink it. It kind of looks like a milk. Kids, be aware. Wait, what are kids being aware of now? This. I'm not eating. Okay. Do not eat this. This is not food. Now it says to add in some food coloring. What color should we make this, guys? Green. Green? All right. And can you do the honors? One, two, two, three. Two, three. <laughs> All right, always start off with less food coloring. The more food coloring you put in, the more your hands are gonna turn that color. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. That's cool. So now it says, tap your fingers hard on the surface of the slime. Now push your fingers slowly into the slime and stir. What happens when you push hard? Ooh, ooh, feel it guys. Put your fingers in there. So what happens, so there's, here's a science experiment on this slime. When you pick it up, it, at first you can touch it, but then it turns completely into liquid and it goes right back no, they into said. its liquid state. No. Should we add some more and see what happens? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Oh man, look at that. Ooh. Can I try? What a cool texture. Can I? Oh, I got some. Whoa. So the more cornstarch you add, it kind of turns into this really weird looking, like look at that, and then it turns into <laughs> slime. Like look at that. And then <laughs> Oops. Now we're going to do my slime, the Franken slime. Ooh, it's a lot. What you need is cornstarch, food coloring, and water. I'm going to add in the water. And I'll mix it. Be a good mixer. I'm going to put the cornstarch into the... Slime-o-meter. 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 Slime-o-slime-o-slime-o-meter. Slime-o-meter. McKinley is going to turn on the Snapple-nader. Here we go. Now we're gonna add in uh, all different kinds of colors of food coloring. We'll add in one drop of each. Ooh. It's getting all sciency in here. Make sure it doesn't touch. Oof. Now we're gonna snap the lid back on and we're gonna see what's gonna happen with this crazy slime. So here we go, watch the colors. For this next 
slime, we're gonna do my favorite, which is the fishing slime blob. But first, before you do this, you actually need to make the slime first itself, which is from the blob slimes. And you can do the blob or the blobby slime brothers. Let's get started. We need glue and water. And we're gonna put it in the mixing bowl. Go ahead. Slowly for sure. And we need our stirring mixer. Do you want to mix? Mix it up. Together. Good. Now we need our activator. Get us our activator. I'll just tap it. That looks so cool. Sticky slime. Sticky slime. Mixing. Mixing feels like rubber. It's breaking. My slime always turns into eggs. I don't know why. All right, round two. Let's try that again because if you guys just watched, I totally just failed and broke that last slime and it turned into like eggs. So we're gonna try that again. Round two is a success. We now get to do the fizzing slime blah that you guys have all been waiting for. So we got to pat the slime down flat. Fly it down flat right here for a minute, and we're gonna put the baking soda in there. It says put in baking soda, so we'll just put a little. Oh, you <laughs> put too much. Let's take a little bit of that away. And then we gotta fold it like a dumpling. So we're gonna fold it into a dumpling. Then we're gonna place the dumpling in the slime -onator. Yeah! Good excitement, Daddy. That was some good excitement. And we're gonna watch what happens. Can you turn it on? Go ahead. <laughs> Turn me into bubbles! We did it! Yay! It's fizzy! And that was so much fun! Yeah, it was so much fun! I loved it. This was a great science experiment. The pros, definitely there are some cool science experiments to be had, especially with the cornstarch. I definitely liked while using the slimalnator. Some cons are is that it doesn't come with any of the ingredients. It only comes with the equipment. So parents, if you do uh, try this out, make sure that you do have all the ingredients that's included and you do actually have to use some of your own extra bowls and mixers yourselves. Well, I had fun with MK Expert and Little Sassy Gabby. So make sure you guys leave a like on this video, subscribe, and if you have any questions on the science experiments that we did, make sure you leave a comment. Um, we'll be checking them out. Soap! It actually comes with um, a package where you can send to your friends. What do you do with them? You make your own soap. We're going to make star soaps, cupcake soaps, and emoji soaps.